Hello, hello, and welcome once again. Jay76NY here. The 5th of July, 1942, finds us fighting for Milne Bay and defending Port Moresby. Uh, Guadalcanal just fell to us, uh, so we have uh, more than enough troops to send back to hopefully push this over the edge. Um, then we're going to focus on other things, but for now we've got uh, the remnants of the transport convoy down here that we hit with our Dauntlesses in the last episode. Uh, I'm assuming they're going to pull out. Um, I'm going to reroute these guys so they're not so far in advance. They've got 368 miles, so they should be able to track them uh, fairly well. Uh, Enterprise is down here. Uh, 0.1 hours before she can launch again. Um, I have a bad habit of forgetting things, and uh, you guys are pretty good about reminding me. Um, Enterprise has Avengers that can bomb from altitude. They're not just torpedo planes that get shot down. Uh, so I'm going to launch out some Avengers. We've also got more uh, Dauntlesses here, but uh, I'm going to hold them in reserve for now. Um, also, Weather is something I always seem to forget about. So, I will make a conscious effort to check the weather more often to see where these transport convoys and battle groups may be hiding. And uh, hopefully we can come across the uh, warships of this group and take all of them out. That would give us a nice boost in command points. We have 35 right now. Uh, we don't get a lot from our uh, sinkings, but each sinking goes towards the total of 100. Uh, if we take a look at what we've sunk so far, um, we've sunk a few of their carriers. We did sink the uh, Issei battleship, both of the Zuihos, uh, mostly merchants, quite a few uh, heavy cruisers. And a few light cruisers, some destroyers thrown in there. And our total is 61. For a tonnage sunk of 494,467, we have lost uh, destroyers, a couple merchants, uh, several submarines, and ships in total. Uh, right now in our dockyard, we've got the uh, Juno and the Dewey, 17 days and 19 days uh, for them to return. So, plan for today is finish off this group, hopefully retake Milne Bay, and then we can progress the campaign in a forward direction instead of just a static straight line, taking, retaking. You know the drill. So sit back, relax, and enjoy today's episode. Nine ships, maybe a couple battleships, who knows. Lost sight of these guys over here as usual. Seems like they vanished pretty quick. So uh, we have this to deal with. We have Trusty. So Steven, you'll be happy with this. If I don't get him killed, that is. Trusty's in the area. I got Dauntlesses in. I've pulled them out a little further out. They're going to kind of sit along the periphery until uh, Trusty makes her attack and then go from there. Um, may have to use them to, uh, or at least some of them to protect Trusty from any meddling destroyers, but we're going to see what we can do here.
All right, so Trusty is moving to get out of the way of the group. Um, they are pretty close uh, right now. I did have her targeting for Itaka, for Utaka. Um, but this destroyer is pretty close. Uh, we may miss the chance to take a strike at the uh, the destroyer or the uh, cruiser there, unless we do our two stern tubes, but. We can only launch one at a time with that anyway, so. Like, we may actually. I don't know. If I, if I turn her. Right now. See, what I want to do here. We got our Dauntlesses in the area, too. Um, so. I'm going to send. Four of them. Nice. I did form them all up. Uh, right, four of them. We're going to drop them down to altitude. And send them down here. We may... Uh, yeah, we may... Use them to uh, protect Trusty. Because Trusty's going to... Oh, shit happens. Alright, that uh, sub, is, or that destroyer is going to see us the second we launch. I may have to change my uh, Yeah, see, I don't know. I mean, 68% solution? It's not bad. We'd still be able to shoot. But the problem being... Oh, sorry. Here's this fella right here. He looks nasty. We do have merchant ships in the group, too. Uh, there's a destroyer following the Chitose. So... really want to hit that for Ataka. Oh, I wonder if I could launch. Launch, uh... Launch six torpedoes on the Furataka. If I can. This step. That's gonna let that destroyer know we're here, though. Twenty-seven hundred yards. We're basically right off the. Uh, yeah, there we are, right there. That for attack is such a nice target, though. <laughs> they aren't pinging us or anything. Gotta be like 400 yards out of. I'm gonna hold off. I'm not gonna do this. I'm not gonna get Rusty killed. The Tose. Let's uh, start backing off a little bit. We got our Dauntless is coming in. Have them. We'll have them in position to hit a destroyer if need be. Oh god, the rest of them are leaving. Whoops! Alright, we'll get back there as fast as you can. Alright, Trusty is backing off. Well, she doesn't commit suicide. Jose's 4,000 yards out. All 
right, well, these guys got about 50 miles to come back to uh, join the fight. These guys are in position to defend Trusty. Um, we'll, uh, we'll make our strike here in a second with Trusty and then get her out. Uh, hopefully sink the destroyer that comes after her. I'm pretty sure that's going to be at least one, if not two. Oh. Another supply convoy, a light supply convoy this time. But between Trusty and the uh, Dauntless, or the, uh, yeah, the Dauntlesses, we should be able to take these guys out pretty easy. Mission kill, right? Chitose sinking. And so far, only one of our destroyer friends are uh, coming in on us. Uh, we did have one miss, but that is a pretty good outcome. Pretty good outcome. Now, looking at what we have in terms of merchant ships, we have one, two, three. Three merchants, the rest are uh, warships. So, uh, <coughs> sorry, we're gonna, oops, we're gonna get, uh, let's grab, grab the first nine Dauntlesses. And then, we're gonna start move them out like this and I'll separate them into groups of three uh, we've got these two groups of two that are uh, looking to protect trusty down here but I, I don't really think uh, this guy may be looking to cause some problems We could probably do something about that. He's the only one that's not heading in the other direction. Unless he's just trying to get around. Uh, now he's he's coming at us. Let's uh, target him. Send these guys in on a dive bombing attack. As Trusty makes her way out. Uh, we're going to have her head a bit north. Um... The other, not sure why it didn't separate them out into the group of nine that I wanted. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, break, warm up. Why is it selecting them all? I, oh, this is so annoying. All right, so we'll go from uh, number 10. break them then maybe form them up to, there we go there we go not sure why it wouldn't do that on its own but 
All right, blue squadron. Have you come back? These guys can circle for now. Dauntless is, whoops. Very good hits on that. Destroyer there. Couple misses. Uh, moderate, moderate. Lost two of the four, so 22 and 24. up. Now oh, she's turning around. Guess that was a little much for her. Alright. Okay, so these guys group of nine here we're gonna get you in on the attack uh, targeting the three merchants plus he's gonna slow way down stay in the area uh, release her from silent if we have uh, ships that are damaged and immobile she can always move in on them All right, grab the first three. This obviously isn't going to work. Grab the first three. Put them in a line ahead. Slow them down. Pick our target. Target number six. Next group of three. Target number two. And the next group of three. Convenient of them to have me all in one little group here. Target number seven. Well, that destroyer looks like she's coming back around. We have to pick... Uh, Couple more Dauntlesses here. Warm them up. Down. Have you come back? Forget that destroyer. Whoops. Oh, I botched that. Had him going too fast. Alright, well. Come up and make another pass at it, I guess. They're going nice. Alright, they're going nice. Okay. Our first first target's going to be number six.
then our second target will probably be the group seven on this guy here, number seven. Try and come at him, bow on. That's good. Going 10 knots. Burning. Nope. See how we did on this guy. He's a beefy looking fella. I do think that groups of two work out a lot better. Alright, second group. Maybe. Let's just have them come down like this. And we'll assess the damage and see what we have to do here. They actually send Trusty after the uh, after the damaged ships. Drop. That guy's smoking out there. I don't think he's as damaged as I would have liked. Great. Check the uh, report here. Uh, heavy and heavy and heavy and heavy, so... Still, uh, me too. Oh my god, they're way out there. Oops, haha. Uh -huh. They're coming in on number two here. Number two's doing ten knots, running straight. Probably gonna have to send uh, two more after each cargo ship uh, to get them down. Trying to keep tabs on that destroyer out there. So the first group here, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Break and form up. See how we did. Oops, there he is over there. Magazine explosion, so he's done. Makes me happy. 
Uh, number five, this is the damage destroyer. I don't know if she's coming after us or not. Can't really tell. All right, so the rest of our Donaluses are now overflying the. Got eight of them. Okay, number two is sinking. So I'm going to send two more groups of two after the other, oops, two more groups of two. After those, oh my god. Okay, hang on. That's the last remnants of one of the transport ships. The other two are also sinking. This one is going down. And then one of them sank on its own. This one right here. They even have to attack it again. Um, but we've got, we've got a couple groups that are uh, moving in on the attack here. Uh, looks like this destroyer is getting frisky with the, uh, the trusty, so uh, these guys who still have their bombs are going to go after them. Uh, I've got another, I think it's, uh, yeah, 19 and 20 are also going after this destroyer that's coming at the trusty. Uh, let's see how far out they are here. 4,000 yards. We're out. So yeah, it's a, been a successful attack so far. Wasn't expecting this one to sink on its own because uh, it was only heavy and Heavy and heavy, so, but I'm not complaining. Right, I did send four Dauntlesses and two groups of two after this destroyer here. Uh, she's moving in on Trusty. I don't like that. <laughs> so, we've got these two groups of two that are gonna make a dive bombing run and then uh, this big group over here is uh, they're all diving on her uh, nice there we go take the wind out of her sails, but like I was saying, this big group of uh, however many, we're all going to strafe, every single one of them, just in case she decides that that's not enough damage, uh, where are you, heavy and moderate, so it's probably not enough damage, these guys are going to move in to strafe, we'll grab... All of them. Bring them up into a line ahead. We gotta get down there pretty quick. 
Uh, and then this group here, uh, we've got five Nautiluses. Furitaka is going to be their target. We're going to split them into... Groups of two and one. We'll get the targeting done here while we wait. And then we'll get them moving in that general direction there. I had the uh, the individual plane go in first. Slow these other two groups down. Right, here comes our uh, comes our strafing run. Let's destroy her. Going nine knots. Got a lot of Dauntlesses. <laughs> About to strafe a destroyer. Yeah, why not? Why not? Do it, guys. Do it. All right, we got this one single Dauntless left to uh, make his attack on the uh, cruiser there. Uh, the destroyer that we strafed did actually sink. So that is a good thing. And away he goes. Uh, exit stage left so you don't get shot down. We did lose, uh, <coughs> I want to say about three Dauntlesses. Damaged the uh, heavy cruiser. We'll see if we can get another hit here. It's not bad damage. It's, whoops, sorry about that. Moderate and none, plus whatever this happens to be. Nothing. Didn't do anything to him. Moderate and none, but we got all of the cruise, cruise ships. <clears throat> we got all of the... Uh, All of the merchants, plus one of the destroyers that was uh, coming after Trusty. Trusty, who is way out there now and safe. But we got the Chitose, the three merchants, and uh, heavily damaged or moderately damaged for Ataka here. So. I would say that's a decent attack 
uh, minor damage on this other destroyer. Light cruisers are untouched. And I think uh, we're going to call that one a day. Six command points gained, which will give us 42, 41, actually. All right, so these guys are down here. Uh, Trusty is still in the area. She's going to stay close in on Milne Bay. They say send something else. Uh, I've got scouts out trying to keep an eye on this area here. Uh, Task Force Mac is patrolling directly in front of Port Moresby, hopefully to intercept anything that happens to come across. Uh, I'm going to tighten up her patrol pattern a little bit. I could actually go inside the circle. I don't know why I'm trying to avoid it. We'll keep her in this general area doing maneuvers like that. Uh, Enterprise. Any launch yet? Half an hour or 50 minutes, whatever. Dauntlesses still have 435 miles of endurance. So they're going to try and keep tabs on this area here. Five Dauntlesses we lost. So if we can come across the uh, group again, get some more planes up, we can hit them. But as is the same as the beginning of the uh, episode, we'll probably lose them. But if we send them back... That's fine. Mission kill. And I'm happy to uh, accept that. Uh, Got to make sure we keep tabs on this area over here too. So next objective is Shortland. And uh, got a bunch of groups headed back. Tautog's headed. Now this is something that I did. Um, I wasn't going to do this, but... Uh, Tautog is going to pick up station in between Okinawa and Iwo Jima and patrol there. It may bring out a couple more subs and do the same thing, keep them up in this area here. Maybe try and intercept something juicy. But I'm not entirely sure of that right now. With my main objective being to uh, recapture the Solomons, I think... Uh, the firepower is needed down here, but I'll keep this uh, as an open option.